So now that I have shared with you how to find an agent, let me share with you what it is that we can do to help you. You'd be surprised how many first time buyers tell me that they think that they need to be the ones looking up all the homes and all of the information, when in reality, that is our job. So what are some of the things that we can help you with? First of all, when we are searching for properties for you, we want to make sure that we're actually sending you any homes that might fit your needs based on what you tell us. So it is extremely important that you share with us all of your wants and your needs. Anything that would be a deal breaker, please tell us. It's not that you're being too picky, but we want to make sure that we're not wasting each other's time or we're not sending you any homes that you're not even going to consider. I hear it all the time when I'm talking to first time buyers that have worked with other agents. They tell me, you know what? I had to switch agents because the one I was originally working with kept on sending me homes that I didn't like. And they were in the areas that I told them I didn't even want to consider. So make sure that your agent is listening to you and your needs, because this might affect you in your transaction or the way that you feel just as you're moving forward, searching for homes. So along with that, other things that we can do for you is whenever there is a home that possibly has an addition or something that was added on or expanded or changed, we can look and see if these parts of the home were actually permitted or not permitted. When something is permitted, there's no problem. We're good to go. But if there is something in the home that was done that did not have permits, this could possibly affect your loan and getting approved. And not just that, but even affect the value of the home. So again, we're here to be a resource for you. We have so many different connections, whether we need to talk to the city or the county or an inspector or, or whoever it is, we just wanna make sure that you're making the best choice of whatever home it is that you want to proceed in submitting an offering and even at the end of the day, purchasing. Hi there, I'm Loida Velasquez, Realtor.com, first time home buying expert and agent with Team BC at eXp Realty. Is working with an agent really necessary? In today's video, I will be sharing with you how to find an agent, ways that an agent can help you, smart questions to ask them, and what not to do when working with an agent. So if you're a first time buyer, let us be your go-to resource for all of your first time home buying needs. Be on the lookout for a lot more videos regarding your home search, closing the deal, submitting an offer, and so much more. If you enjoy this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up, share it with someone else, and also subscribe to this channel. Also, remember to go to realtor.com, buy your resource center for a lot more tips and articles that you can get informed about. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one.